Hello and welcome to your own channel. Let's talk business once again. As always, I'm excited to have you here. Today video presentation, we are going to discuss about the Lloyd's ambitious project under the future of Lloyd's program called Claim Solution. I'm going to discuss this claim solution in two parts. Earlier, I thought to deliver the entire piece in one presentation, but then I realized that this is going to be too bulky. So I divide into two parts. So we are going to discuss part A in this video presentation and part B will be soon available. So the claim solution is basically a technological driven solution at its core. The system will be heavily dependent on complex risk platform and the Lloyd's risk exchange for policy data. So if you are not aware about the complex risk platform and the risk exchange, then you can click on the information bar above. To see, I have already covered both the complex risk platform and risk exchange in this series. All right. And over the period of time, it is expected that the claim platform will replace the current electronic claim file system. Now, I have already created a video presentation about the electronic claim. You can click on top of this information bar to access this video presentation. So, as always, there is a lot to know and a lot to discuss. So, without waiting more, let's start talking business. So for those who are new to my channel, I am Ravi Shankar. I am having more than 16 years of experience in business analysis, largely associated with PNC, general insurance domain, currently practicing in Lloyd's. If you have any queries related to this video presentation or my previous video presentations, you can write me at my Hotmail email ID. Alternatively, you can connect me at my LinkedIn profile as well as a paid tutor handle. Once again, thanks a lot for all your messages, all your suggestions, all your email. I really, really love them all. Thank you and keep them coming. So let's start talking business. So what is this claim solution all about and what we are going to achieve through this claim solution? So claim solution is basically a digital solution, as I said earlier, that will help to triage route claim. And then it will also help to automate the decision making for the simplest claim and also assess the complex risk claim handling, you know, basically to speed it up. So this is going to be underpinned by the advanced orchestration platform, which will help to improve the customer experience. Now, what is this orchestration platform? How it is going to improve the customer experience? We will be going to discuss in the subsequent slide. Then claim related to policies placed or renewed through risk exchange and complex risk platform will be center of this solution. So as I said earlier, this will be heavily dependent on risk exchange and the complex risk platform in order to access the policy data or renewal policy data. And the entire integration will help to improve the total turnaround time. And if you are improving the total turnaround time, so ultimately you are improving the customer experience. So let's move forward. So this is the overall structure of claim solution. So we have policy holder, broker, managing agent over here. Then we have a central services over here. And these blue box are the various components within the claim solution. We have over here the multi-channel interface, triaging segmentation, and the first notice of loss. Then we have a very smart workflow over here. We will discuss what this workflow will do. And then we have a different stream of different type of claim, which will be handled through the smart workflow. So we have a simple claim, which is largely processed through STP. Then we have non-complex claim, which will be largely processed. 80% will be processed through STP and remaining 10 20% will require some sort of manual handling. And then we have a complex bigger claim that required a lot of human involvement in order to assess the claim. So if you can see over here, the component, the component number one, two, three, four, five, six, which is in green, are scope of part A of this video presentation. And the component, which is in yellow, which means that the centrally procured services, streamlined claim, accounting operation, and the event observer will be part of presentation B. Let's start understanding what is this individual component all about. So first thing is about the multi-channel interface. And this will enable a simple digital submission of the loss information, which will help to improve the transparency, ultimately enhancing the customer experience. Now, what is going to happen? The customer and broker will intimate the claim and provide the essential information and document through this interface. And this information and the document will be available to managing agent and broker and TPA via the application programming interface APIs. So what is happening over here is the customer will put the information into this interface, all the policy and document information, and this information 
will be available to the agent system, to the managing agent system, to TPS system with the help of API, application programming interface. And basically, API will help to exchange the information between various systems. So this is a technical subject we are not going to get into detail. But yeah, this will help to exchange the information. Then the second thing is this will also increase the transparency while processing the real-time data, which is controlled by the proper access control. So the data which is flowing from one system to another system is properly controlled by the access so that the right information will be flowed to the right people to help them to take right decision at right time. And again, the idea is to improve the turnaround time. The third thing is about this interface will be customizable for each user and this will work across the latest communication map, which means that it is compatible with web, mobile, tablets, email, phone, and this will enhance the customer experience by strengthening the relationship between the policyholder and the customer and the TPAs and the, all the stakeholder which is involved within the system. So this is about the multi-channel interface. Going forward, then we have a triaging engine and the segmentation, very, very important and exciting uh, component. And this will be applicable across the claim life cycle, starting from the F1 level to the settlement of the claim. And this triaging engine will be based on various artificial intelligence technology. So Lloyds is using advanced technologies to support this claim solution. And they have already set up the Lloyds lab where they are keep on testing a new technologies with the new technology providers. So cooperation of Lloyds is going to play a very, very important role here. The cooperation of Lloyd will control and maintain the central claim triaging engine with the help of market input. So these guys will be managing all the rule which is required to triage the claim effectively. So basically, this triaging engine will use the first notification of loss to automatically access the policy information from Lloyd Risk Exchange or Complex Risk Platform. Lloyd Risk Exchange and Complex Risk Platform. So I, I'll, I'll encourage you to go back and see what are these two solutions to understand this piece fully. Now, this is also going to retrieve the critical and external information from the third party system. Again, these information will require to process the claim faster. And finally, this system will also recommend on the indemnity amount, coverage decision, possibility of fraud, and this will be supported by the advanced analytics and the structured data and the aggregated historical market data to take the better action. As I said, the triaging will be using the latest routing and handling processes in order to manage claim more effectively. So when I'm saying that handling processes, which means that this triaging engine will send the claim to simple claim bucket, or maybe it will send it to the non-complex claim route or complex claim route based on certain rules. So we will see what are these work stream, uh, what is simple claim, what is non-complex and what is complex claim work streams. So let's talk about the first handling process, which is STP for simple risk, this part, the component number four, and this will help to settle the high volume and simple claim, which is less than 5,000 pound through a business rule and automatic checks. And uh, let me show you a very interesting analysis over here. So if you can see over here, 48% of open market and regions claim close between 2016 and 2018 were 5,000 or below. And the accounting collectively will less than 1% of the total indemnity value. So if you can see over there, the total indemnity value is less than 1%. On the other side, and the top 3% of the claim represents 66% of the total incurred claim cost, if you can see over here. So the idea is basically to automate this part the 48% so that the time will get free up and the underwriters can focus more on this high value claim to deliver better solution. And how this part is going to get handled through STP and various other mechanisms with the help of latest advanced technologies. So going back over here, 
Now, a governing body which represents the market representations and the stakeholders from the market will set up the business rule for the complexity and indemnity threshold for triaging. The STP will be delivered using the artificial intelligence and the data driven business rule, which will eliminate the manual processes from the entire life cycle. The idea is to bring down the entire settlement life cycle within two days to the help of this STP process. Now, it is also going to have an event of observer and this event observer will be built to collect the external information to enable the claim solution to send early notification alerts and access the claim before the policy holder are aware about the insurance losses so say for example uh, you, you are facing a flood situation somewhere and uh, policy holders are already distressed due to this flood situation but what will happen this event observer will understand that there is a flood and it will trigger the information into the system and this automated trigger will actually log the claim even before the policy holder is aware about that there is a situation where he has to log the claim. So ultimately it's going to speed up the entire process to improve the turnaround time. And then it's going to have a parametric contract and insurance link securities where the simple trigger will enable the touchless claim payment will further benefit it from the STP. So what is happening over here, if you can see the nature of this parametric contract or ILS, so this contract will be triggered based on some event, okay? So some event and some condition. So say for example, if this event observer identify this condition, then it will trigger this contract and this contract will immediately make payment. Well, I'll give you a very classic example, your travel policy. So your travel policy, the event to settle your claim is, say for example, flight delay for more than five hours okay the moment this flight delay event happened so policyholder no need to do any action right because this event is real and authentic so the this parametric insurance contract will be immediately get triggered and the payout will happen to the policyholder account so the entire process is very efficient and the turnaround time is very very low so going forward too, we have already covered this. So in handling process two is about the non-complex claims. So basically these are simple claim only, but will require a few manual interventions. So what we'll be having a market claim services for non-complex claim that is still required one or two human intervention to reach to the conclusion. So we will see what is this market claim services and it's going to play a very, very important role over here. So if you can see over here, to manage the non-complex claim, the market claim service, which is centrally managed outsource claim service for non-complex claim. And this service will help managing agent to manage this claim. The managing agent, what will do, they will delegate some of their authority to this market claim service group to manage this claim and take the action on behalf of the managing agent itself. So say for example, they will define some sort of rules and based on these rules, this market claim services will actually take action and to improve the claim turnaround time by just simplifying the process. And this will help managing agent to delegate non-complex claim to, and this will deal with those claims that required some level of simple human intervention as we discussed earlier. The collaboration tool will enable the real time interaction with the expert stakeholder to speed up the process. And this, they are going to utilize the latest collaboration tool like video conferencing, chatting, GPS, satellite imaging, drones, etc. in order to do some sort of survey. And the entire thing is to improve the experience of claim. And this will be using the advanced automation, which means that many claims can be returned to the straight through processing branch after one or two human interventions so so that it will get settled as soon as possible so the service will be composed of several strands and each strand will manage different part of the claim so say for example this is the service these are the different strands and these strands will manage the different part of the claim so say for example these guys are managing the fnul these guys are managing the information from the external sources these guys are managing the ils or maybe a parametric claim solutions and the idea behind is that no one authority will manage the entire claim and if one authority is not managing the entire claim this will automatically reduce a lot of the dependency on the people or the processes and ultimately to speed up the, the claim settlement process 
in addition to the non complex claim handling the market claim service will partner with the data and the technology provider and expert to form the innovation hub for the data science and artificial intelligence so this is not all about the outsourcing or market claim service group will also engaged in identifying more innovative ways to settle the claim and improve the customer experience now moving forward the third part is the complex claim and how we are going to handle the complex claim and this will be achieved by providing the greater empowerment for the lead underwriter to handle and settle the complex claim with multi million pound in value so what is happening you know whenever you are uh, making the mrc market reform contract this will be having a very important document called claim scheme and this claim scheme document will have all the rules and regulation between the lead action party and follower and this actually set out the condition that what leads is going to do in the event of claim what this action party is going to do in the event of claim and the follower will do in the event of claim so what is going to happen is this claim scheme will be further improved to provide greater flexibility to the lead in order to take the better decision now if you can see over here there is another initiative which is happening within the future of lloyds program which is called the modern syndication of risk but in modern syndication of risk you know the, we will see probably we are enhancing this claim scheme into further greater detail and this entire thing the simple claim and the non complex claim and the complex claim the process will be managed by the smart workflow and the orchestration services which we discussed earlier so let's see what is this smart flow so if you can see over here the smart workflow is a market wide claim messaging and orchestration services for effortless and efficient claim management and this smart workflow is actually managing all these trends and all these business rules workflow and messaging will be defined under this smart workflow and this is to ensure that the appropriate market participant is taking the right action at the right time so modern and flexible technology will support the faster easier negotiation and resolution of the claim queries within this smart flow system and this will also ensure to manage the single version of the truth within the entire claim life cycle and this component will replace the ecf system going forward in future so this is all about the part a we have covered the multi channel interface triaging segmentation first notice of loss smart workflow simple claim non complex and complex claim and in the next video presentation which is part b we are going to discuss about the centrally procured services streamlined claim operation and event observer i hope you have learned something from this video presentation thanks for listening god bless you all bye bye thank you